What's up, Collective? Welcome back to the Karmic Circus. Where we expose all of these karmic ass clowns. So let's find out what's going on with the karmic ass clowns. Please keep in mind, this reading may trigger you. Only take the parts that's resonating with you and leave the rest for somebody else. If it don't fit, don't force it. Just relax and let that shit go. Alright? Alright. I'll put this thumb counter on. Okay. Now this this karma can be your person, your karmic current person, karmic masculine, karmic feminine. This could even be a family member. This could be your ex. Your ex is ex. Okay. This could be a karmic neighbor or karmic's uh heard a social worker. <laughs> Who's dealing with a, a social worker? Hmm. Okay, so Holy Spirit. Show me the energy surrounding the karmics. Oh, so they're playing with Ouija boards. They conjured up some sort of spirit. Or they paid something. Somebody. And now they're afraid to spend their own money. Okay, so we're showing the energy surrounding the karmics and the concerns the divine collective, what the energies. Some shit is backfiring on. What's the energy surrounding the karmics? They running from some fiery maids. Something that they wanted to be happening to you. Okay. For some reason, my son always scoots all the way to the edge. Even though I end up taking the camera off of him, some part of his body ends up in my film. In my content. Okay. So it's a karmic energy. She could be running away from a masculine. She. She tried to give. This masculine something or this masculine tried to give her something. She wanted a uh, equal give and take with this masculine. Like she wanted to be with him or, you know, partners and all of this. And, and it ain't going that way. She's running away from some shit. He could have been, you know, he could have gave her some sort of drug. He could have tried to burn her up. He could have, like, beat the up, but it was no equal give and take in this relationship. And the overall energy, she's running away. No, she's not. She's in this, all of this shit that this karmic is going through with this masculine, she's still not running away. She's still not leaving. There's no ten of cups. No two of cups. She's still staying. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> uh, uh. Now, this person, she could be a Cancer Pisces or a Scorpio. And the masculine could be a fire sign. 
Even though she's going through tower moments, she's still staying. This is a female who's who's um no the the heart of the energy is a king of cups. Somebody who's emotionally mature, generous, open, and trusting. It's a high priestess. Now this is oh okay this is the divine the divine masculine. He's this king of cups, and he's he's it's a, a devil energy trapped to him, or he could have an addiction. He could be you know feeling restricted. It's a Capricorn energy out here that he could be attached to. But there is no, he's he's now, this is a masculine that he's realizing that this relationship with this Carmen is not what it what is what he thought it was. Mm -mm. She's a devil. This this karmic, she don't take spiritual baths, she don't, you know, protect herself. She's not on a spiritual journey. this masculine running for or if he ain't running he thinking about it or he's trying to he may feel like he's running to avoid a tower moment yeah but this this is not is not going well between them because he didn't realize this karmic has the devil in her and she's not going to change Okay, show me how this masculine feels towards this karmic energy. Show me how this masculine feels about this karmic. Wow. So this is the masculine energy. He feels like this karmic is a gift or she's gifted. Even though there's no equal give and take in a the relationship, there's no love and happiness. This is why he haven't ran away. <laughs> he's still in that fiery maze. He don't feel like he's having a tower. He feel like he's avoiding towers. Okay. Clarify what this gift is. When it comes to this karmic, how this is masculine. See this karmic. Clarify the gift folks here. He's not running away. This is his karmic ex. He's not running away from her. He feels like she's she's a gift. He feels like she's a gift and she's gifted and she looks away from her gifts. He feels like this karmic looks more for sex than she does her gifts. How else does this masculine feel about this karmic? He could have moved back. They could have lived in the same state or city. And he could have moved away from her. Or she's looking at. She's not looking at, at the gift. She's looking out the window. At something towards another city or another state. Probably another country. Okay. Whatever gift it is. She's not looking at. Okay. she's. This is a, a, a karmic energy that. Uses her body to get what she wants. Okay. Tell me more how this masculine feels about this karmic energy. And he know the relationship ain't going nowhere. Or he feel like she's trying to stop him from going somewhere. 
or he's trying to stop her from leaving. Tell me more spirit about how this masculine nice feels about this point. He truly loves her. He has a child with her. She's not his wish come true, but he loves her. He be giving her money or she gives him money. This is a karmic that moved back to your master. Okay. feels that he made an unwise decision but he loves her well the love ain't out here it's money she give him money mm -hmm. she probably be wiring him money or he's giving her money but I asked how did this masculine feel about this Carmen and this is a fiery bridge that he likes to cross he may travel to see her a lot which is an unwise decision and he feels like this is the pathway that he's supposed to be going. And that's not for everybody, but it's for somebody. Your masculine feels like he's doing the right thing with this karmic energy, even though there's no equal give and take in the relationship, even though it's not a family life. Mm -hmm. It's all about the money she gives him. And if she got if she got kids with this masculine, those ain't his kids. This was on the bottom of the deck as I picked it up. So those ain't his kids. This masculine or somebody sold they soul to destroy another. So this masculine, he could have, you know, got with this karmic, got pregnant with her, married her. That's selling his soul if he did it to, he did that just to hurt you and he's gonna get hurt. Because it ain't gonna turn out the way that he planned. Or the way she planned. Okay. So show me more energy surrounding this this karmic, this masculine and this karmic. That he could be he's a uh, divine masculine who's been demoted to karmic. <laughs> show me the energy between this masculine and karmic. Okay, those ain't his kids, but he still ain't ran away. It may take some time, but the truth will come out. Masculine, it's okay to cry. Missing your energy. They broke your heart. Bisexual male. Take a deeper look. If I could take back everything I've done, I would, but I can't. We have a Tesla here. Okay, so this is the heart of the energy is this person broke your heart. Those ain't his kids. Okay. This masculine could be crying about this. That he's been with this karmic. He could have married her and he find out that those ain't his kids. Okay. This masculine could also be bisexual. Something you maybe need to take a deeper look at. And this masculine is saying that if he could take back everything, he, he got regrets. And this he broke your heart. By dealing with this other person. Which was an unwise decision that he made. But he's only dealing with this person because she's giving him money. She could be wiring him money. Um, cash apping him money. And all he do is, you know, go down there every few months and hit it and come back. And still do his dirt back in another whole city or state. So you be careful of this type of masculine, okay? Well, the feminine could be the, the you know... These are people who use their bodies to make a living, okay? 
They hoes. Prostitutes. Thoughts. They sell their soul. Somebody didn't finish high school. Sleeping with them but thinking about you. Twisted minds think alike and together. Money, cash, bank account. He threatened the karma to get an abortion because he don't want kids with her. Got caught busted cheating. Third eye. Thinking about how dirty they done. And she's a cat licker. So this masculine is just a fool behind this karma. She have to be doing some sort of spell work or manipulation on him. For him not to want to run away from this situation and sleeping sleeping with them and thinking about you, but he's still there with her. And he's he's thinking about you and he's thinking about how how dirty this karmic is doing. But he stayed there because she giving him money. Hmm. He twisted and she twisted too, and twisted minds think alike. Mm, mm, mm. Yeah, he can't. He ain't running away from this fire. He ain't protected against this fire. Tell me more. Um, how's this masculine? I mean, this karma. Now, this masculine is the gold digger. Now, it could be the opposite way. It could be this karmic feminine. She could be the gold digger, and this masculine could be a karmic masculine. Okay. Okay, well, tell me about the gold digger energy. Tell me some characteristics of this gold digger energy. This is a warning. Take heed. Fraud. This gold digger is moving or relocating. See, this karmic is, is relocating because this masculine um, threatened her and told her to get an abortion. And what she's going to do, she's going to take the money and say she's getting the abortion. And then she's going to skip and go to another city or another state and be gone for some months, for nine months. And, um, I'm telling you, ladies, if you doing, if somebody's doing this shit, you setting yourself up, Karmic. Don't do that shit. This man is telling you he don't want this baby. And what you do, you will keep the baby. Now this is for somebody. It's not for everybody because there's two scenarios out here with this Karmic. She'll either, she'll either uh, tell this masculine. That she's pregnant and she's not just to get money for an abortion. Okay. Now, others of you, this karmic will say this masculine um could be then, you know, drop some money in her cash app and telling her to go to you know, to terminate the pregnancy. And she instead of instead of her terminating the pregnancy, she goes and moves somewhere. Okay, she just got the masculine for that little however much money it costs. She got that for him. And she lied. Take it where it resonates. Then what she'll do, if she didn't terminate the pregnancy, she just got the little $200, $300, however much that shit. When I had it done, it was $250, okay? So I don't know how much it's, it's did, how much it costs now. But she took that, you know, she took it, took the money from him, and she skipped town. She didn't need that money because $250 ain't going to get you from one state to another, I don't think. You know, unless she already had made these plans and shipped or whatever. She probably ain't got shit. Okay, but now this masculine is thinking about how, how dirty this Carmen did. And for those are the ones that skipped town and she came back after uh, after she had this baby. Where he gave her the money to get an abortion. You better be careful with shit like that. If you're going to keep the money, if you're going to get an, um, a man tell you to get an abortion... And you don't get it, don't ever bring that baby around him. If he telling you he don't want kids with you, don't ever take that child around him. Because he may kill you and the child. Especially if you if you're you're on that 
toxic energy and you're this man is married and you manipulated him into sleeping with you some sort of way and then you think a baby and you blackmailing him all this shit don't you think that's how females be getting killed some of the men then put that means if his wife find out that he done fucked around with you and he been married with her for over 10 years her ass can turn around and sue the shit out of him and take everything he got just because you slipped something in his dream or just because you went and you know, slid your body all up on him and all that dancing up on him and all of that shit. Thought shit. Okay? Don't go doing that. Because all you're going to do is set yourself up. You're just going to set yourself up and either be stuck with a baby that a man still don't want and don't want you. Or you're going to be abusing that child. Because you don't want it. You thought you was going to play mama and he going to be the dad. But no, he already got a wife. He already got a chick, a woman, somebody he's serious in a relationship with, okay? Now, this is where, now, so this karma, she could be moving. And she she got a cat liquor energy, so she's a lesbian. She go both ways, okay? She looking and she sticking and she getting stuff to her and she is through it, okay? So, tell me more about this karma. And this masculine, he's he's it's like he's not running away from her. He thinks them kids is his, and then they, they ain't even his kids. But he's still staying for the kids. Just been getting frauded all these years. Yep, this is not a friend, they're false. So I'm gonna get some advice for this masculine that's out here dealing with these tricky ass karmas. Okay. And I'm asking you all to hit the thumbs up button to energetically donate to my channel, please. And thank you. This masculine is missing you though, collector. our energy this masculine ain't running away and those ain't his kids and it's like this karmic feminine that he's that, that he's seeing she waits for him she knows he's gonna come because she's giving him and money okay and this masculine he can't find balance when he's dealing with her but he's still staying he ain't left Wow. Tell me more about this karmic and this masculine. Second time, there's no equal give and take in that relationship. He probably ain't giving shit. And the karmic feminine is the one with the money. But she don't want to meet you. She's just doing that baiting him there so he'll stay away from you. And he's stupid. For the love of money is the root of all evil. That's why he don't love himself. She don't love him and nobody loves her ass either. They don't even love each other. They just retarded. <laughs> and I don't believe he had a real girlfriend before I came in. That relationship is not blossoming. It's no balance. It's not it's not growing. No new vitality. nothing but he's still staying because he feel like he can shine by himself they and, and if she in another city or state this masculine out here doing what he want to do and she ain't no way around and when she's around he still do it he don't give a fuck and she don't give a fuck because it's just a money thing there's no love and none of the cards came out it was it was like no love i see the cups out here but it's not no love like family love it's the love of money He's not having though. He liked this shit. <laughs> he liked this shit. He liked this fucked up ass relationship. Damn. 
Ooh, ooh, I guess it, he don't give a fuck if it's off balance because he can do what the fuck he wants. This master must got a lot of money to just be spending it. Ooh, ooh. I guess. I guess, masculine, you got it like that? Or she got it like that? Dreams ain't coming true? Mm-mm. No. <laughs> this shit giving me a hot flash. How can this motherfucking masculine be this goddamn dumb? Oh, shit. Mm, 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 mm. Whose energy is that? Now, if this is resonating with you, please put it in the comments. Because um, this is a dumbass masculine. This, this woman has to... She didn't put some spell work on him. She didn't put some spell work on him. Mm-hmm. That's, that's all the energy. I, I, I don't see how no man could deal with some shit like this. For money. I don't even think they're having sex. That's how dumb he is. You dumb fuck. You dumb. He don't care anyway because he low down. He down low. And he, she's just, she's using him and he's using her. She's she he just have her there because he's not attracted to women. But he uses her. That's why there's no sex. There's no love. There's no equal give and take. She's just a cover up. Oh, I'm married. But he's really fucking his homeboys in another city or another state. And he telling them, oh, my wife, she back there. See, he's lying both ways. He's lying to his home. But he's lying. Like he's living, he's he has a, a whole nother life in another city, another state, right? And he's he's the homeboys and people, you know, they they all fucking. Mm, I gotta get out of this shit. I see y'all in the next week.